many Christians are liars. I'm sure now, some of you, when you move from here, the one you lie to, listen, the one who lie, you lie to, will come and question you exactly what you said. If you, are, you want to defend yourself, if you, def you want to say, no, please, I'm no longer a person who wants to talk about these things. Please. I don't want to. Because you knew you were lying. I don't want to talk about the things like this. Can we talk about other things? Because it's a trap. They never want to catch you again so that what you said here, it will be like you were just talking. I'm sure you're hearing me. Amen. So many of you, you are going to face this thing this week. If you pass it, I'm expecting a testimony. Amen. If you pass it, if you just pass, it's going to be a test. When somebody say, you said one, two, three. Ah, do you remember? And then now when you say it, it means what you did here was zero. What you were doing here, you say, the prayer you've prayed here, you were not praying it. But for you to move forward, you say, Ish, these things, you know, because you lied. You said you are very much educated, isn't it? You lied. I'm very much educated. And you were telling this lady, I'm very much educated. I've got a degree of statistics. But you know, you, you didn't even pass my trick, isn't it, sister? It's not true. You know you didn't even pass my trick. And you lie to this brother. Think about you, you lie and say, I don't have a child. And whereas your child is with your mom at home. The day now they find you, what are you going to do? Because you want to get married. Just think about it, you lie. I don't have a child. I'm a sister C. <laughs> And think about it. What will happen to you? I'm sister what? C. Uh, brother B. At the day they found you have got a child. Always, you must always do like this. You must do like this. Now, the day you found you have got a child somewhere, or maybe you commit abortion. That's the reason you find God can't bless people. Lies. And you are Christian in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The Bible says, we who call the name of Jesus must run away from iniquities. So this is the time now that after you have done all this, know that you are going to face what? A test. You are going to face a test. And in that test, somebody will come and say, you told me you are working in this company. And the person, you say yes. And the person say, I was searching for you. They didn't find you. You lied to me. And whereas the person wants to give you a job, and you say you are working, in the maize meal, you are working maize meal. And you say, ah, oh, no, wonderful. You want to give you a job. You suffer, you lie. Some of you, your lies are, are so special that you lie in the spirit. You just open your mouth. And you know you are talking nothing. You just know the tongues you are speaking means nothing. And sometimes you specialize with your tongues of Z. You think we don't know? You think we don't know? Why? You are failing to read the Bible. And you don't know what to pray now. You just come and say, and later you say, zebra, zebra. And you, you think, 
You think we don't know what is zebra? People are lying too much. Lies everywhere. Claiming the things of the spirit. Who told you that if you won't speak in tongues, you will die? Who told you that? Not long I found someone speaking. Others, they, now they check the alphabet. Another one says Z, others say L, la 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 if you spray in your baby or vendor, it's wonderful. Yes. Until now, God takes over. Yes. Can you just be faithful to yourself? Yes. Can you be faithful to tell your neighbor? Can you be faithful to yourself? Can you be faithful to yourself? I wanted to tell you that some people here, their lies, they lie too much on their age. Many people here, that's why you hear, especially ladies, lie too much on age. That's why you hear them say, I'm tiny. I'm tiny. They, because they don't want to talk their age. They always turn. They want to turn. When a lady wants to get married and he sees you are younger, he just look at you <laughs> and begin to pray in their heart. If you say you are 30, she's 28. <laughs> so, I mean, how can we make people to believe in a lie? Where is it going to come to an end? <laughs> 